In February 2020, IGEL added native support for Microsoft Windows Virtual Desktop to their OS, shipped with the IGEL UD3 Thin Client. This is what it looks like when connecting to WVD from a UD3. Some customers compare the experience of a physical workstation with the experience of WBD using a UD3 thin client. But they forget that almost all physical workstations these days contain a GPU. On the left we have a physical workstation with an NVIDIA M5000 GPU. And on the right an IGEL UD3 connected to a WBD session with a soft GPU. There is no doubt that a GPU-backed workstation has a better user experience. The CPU emulating the GPU is the limiting factor in WVD with soft GPU. But this is comparing apples to oranges. Let's level the playing field and add a GPU to the WVD host pool VM. On the left we are looking at the screen of a physical Intel NUC with an i7 CPU and embedded Iris Pro 580 GPU. On the right it's an IGEL UD3 connected to a WVD session with NVIDIA M60 GPU. The IGEL UD3 on the right connected to WVD with the M60 GPU outperforms the Iris Pro GPU on the left. Only the frame rate on the UD3 screen shows some light stuttering caused by the remote connection. This WebGL workload shows great user experience on both sides, with CPU and frame buffer consumption almost identical, but with much lower GPU load for the M60. The car visualizer workload confirms this observation. Slightly better graphics performance in the UD3 plus WVD session due to superior GPU. Things started looking much better for the IGEL UD3 when connected to a GPU accelerated WVD session. What if we compare different WVD clients when connected to the same WVD session? Let's connect to the same WVD session, on the left from the Microsoft HTML5 WVD client, on the right from the UD3 thin client. It's quite obvious that the HTML5 WVD client on the left cannot keep up with the UD3 WVD client on the right. This OpenGL workload confirms the observation that the UD3 WVD client performance is better even though CPU, GPU and frame buffer consumption is almost identical on both sides. Finally, we are looking at the UD3 client connected to a WVD session with soft GPU on the left and with M60 GPU on the right. There is no doubt. Remote end user experience and graphics performance is much better with a real GPU. The impact of soft GPU versus GPU on user experience is much higher than the impact of different WVD clients. In summary, IGEL UD3 clients provide great performance when connecting to WVD sessions. For great DirectX, OpenGL, WebGL or HTML5 performance, WVD sessions must be GPU accelerated.